Well, good afternoon. Fishing's not going that good, so I figured I'd do a little impromptu introduction slash review of my bougie inflatable setup. We have a Intex Mariner 4. This is the bigger model out of the three and the four. This is 12 feet long by, I believe it's three and a half feet, four feet wide. I think it's 12 feet by four. Um, has a roll up stowaway PVC floor. Um, has an inflatable keel. Very stable, surprisingly. Um, I have it outfitted with the Intex um, outboard transom. We have a Minn Kota 30 pound uh, thrust C2 Endura 5 speed. We have a 100 amp hour uh, deep cycle marine battery in the Minn Kota, uh, I guess, trolling motor power center so you can power your trolling motor. And then you have two cigarette lighter plug ins where you can charge your phone, cameras, or what be it. I have, I have a Garmin Striker 4 portable fish finder. We have a glue-on mount for the transducer arm, and we have a couple Scotties um, rod holders. We've got one there for the bait caster. We've got one there using it to hold the net using a rocket launcher holder. And then we got the other one up there. It did come with two fishing rod holders. Um, these ones are better though if you're trolling because you can actually put them to the sides. We have a Scotty anchor lock in the front makes it way easier to anchor this thing uh, true to the wind on a day like this. Keeps it super stable. I'm standing up. Very surprisingly how stable this is considering it's an inflatable dinghy. Um, I've got these two chairs ordered off Amazon. I can't remember the company. I hate that that I can't remember it. But they're swivel. Inside they have styrofoam inserts that act as coolers. This one I have all my emergency stuff, flotation, flashlight. Uh, air horn and then the one behind me is more so my personal stuff so like wallet keys uh, bottom bouncers GoPro hardware and uh, Yeah, it comes with two oars as well, but this is kind of my bougie setup I Still roll it up and take it down and put it in the bed of my truck when I'm done with it I would love to eventually get a personal watercraft trailer for this and Then it would just make unloading and loading way so much easier uh, and then with that get some maybe other accessories on here such as the bait board in the back and some cup holders but uh, Yeah, we're kind of just using the floor here. I Can fit two people comfortably three would be a little bit cramped, but yeah She sure goes and the 30 pound thrust is more than enough to get this thing going um, With a boat like this. There's no difference between 30 pounds and 55 pounds. They're all governed at the same speed uh, 5k an hour might be able to get going faster, but I mean, for this being 12 feet, this thing kind of gets the job done. So, yeah. You definitely see a lot of Intex Mariners out here on the lakes and the shallow areas, but this one's definitely the, uh, in my mind, the most bougie, and it's about to get more bougie as the years go on. But uh, yeah, we're gonna try going for big pike right here. We're in 10 feet of water.